we don't measure what it is we say we're actually going for, right? Our metrics don't line up with our aspirations. And so the net result is people are going to do what they're measured on, not what you tell them they should be aspiring toward. And the way this plays out often in organizations is we crunch numbers on how much time it takes someone to complete a project. We measure by hours, not by the amount of value that they deliver in the number of hours that they spend on the project. And so over time, what we train people to do is just to get the work done in as few hours as possible and essentially make it acceptable, but make sure that you get it done in as few hours as, as possible, because that's ultimately what we're billing or that's ultimately what we're you know, we're measuring as an organization. So this is that time versus value dilemma that we have as professionals. Creativity takes time. I always say that creativity is not efficient, but it doesn't waste anything, right? What I mean by that is it's not an efficient process. You, there's a lot of churn involved in, the, in, in creating something. You know, you're going to have you're going to have to play with ideas for a while. You're going to have to connect dots. Stephen Johnson calls this exploring the adjacent possible. Play with ideas, connect dots, problem solve. You know, Einstein called it combinatory play. You need to build some of that into the life of your organization in order to get to the true value. But if you're measuring time, often we don't allot enough of it for us to get to that real value.